on idols and I'm gonna announce the winner. <laughs> gonna use those hands this evening but um, this is our, our, our award section uh, where we will, we will be awarding our grade 12s who are here with us uh, it's, it's it's been a wonderful year and an amazing journey with all of them so to hand out a certificate of a certificate of completion I would call forward uh, Coach Utato and Ali Marie as, as per my so may they please come forward. So my name is Tato Mabilani and I'm the head coach for the Learn to Row program and we're going to be issuing out uh, certificates of completion for the wonderful rowers who have been part of the program for the past three years. Alright, cool. Um, the first um, rower that we're going to call up to receive is Ndutugo Shani. Well done. <laughs> The next row we're going to call up is Undipile Papa. Congratulations. The next row is Andile Mwango. Is Liam Mahogana. Okay. <laughs> All right, and last but not least is Temi Mazula. Right, uh, the next uh, award is the Professor Captain Doctor, Reverend. 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 Uh, it is Snyder's Trophy. This is a Spirit Award. Uh, award. Award. <laughs> that is awarded to a grade 12 for excellence in sailing. Now, now the winners of this trophy, um, it's two individuals. That is Anele May and Silvino October. <laughs> this year's group of metrics have been exceptional. So for the first time this year, here is a record, Mr. May, that you can break about after this. The Peter and uh, Julie New uh, Newell Family Special Awards will be received by all of them. I would love to call you Miss Faye Kula and uh, who Miss Lindy Wemawa from the Department of Transport. Yes. The first recipient is Tembi Mazula. Ungupile <laughs> Mbapa. Sikose Tulibalele. Relisha Adams. Banene Mpize. You can have a picture, ladies, and go sit down. <laughs> Thank you very much. Power to invoke Kozo. Dutugo Shange. Olisa Michels, Andile Mongo, Juvandre Williams, Alwande Tap, Giant Whatever Sitone, and Liema Hogana. Time. <laughs> Vino October. Zola Simpson. J. 
Jordan Daily. And Anele May. The next three, as I said, um, are our, our day students, um, whom amongst many um, have been identified as the ones who have mostly carried the, the values of our program. So that will be Jamie Lee Basson, <laughs> Michael Hendricks, Pictures, pictures. <laughs> For the Low Hill Award, now in memory of Uondela Mashia, who was uh, one of the students who unfortunately passed away while she was here, uh, it was very sad. But this award will be awarded to a grade 12 learner who has shown a lot of potential and oomph which we are all about. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, this individual has kept the low hill staff on their toes. And I'm telling you now, <laughs> we have been on our toes. <laughs> I would love to call the hostel parent, uh, Mrs. Noma Kastin, to hand over this award. Now, this special award in memory of Ondela goes to Sipose to <laughs> Uh, we outsourced uh, catering and we've had uh, a wonderful company who feed them, feed them and <laughs> who have uh, done an amazing job. So they have decided that they want to award a learner that has been the most grateful, the most helpful and the most humble student of the year. I would have imagined the one who ate a lot. <laughs> Miss Lauren, uh, to come and hand over the award, please. <laughs> the winner for this uh, award is Silvino October. <laughs> A sailor's home special prize, and this one is awarded to someone, a grade 12, who, ha um, who has used the past three years as challenging as they were to step out of his or her comfort zone and to embrace personal growth and development. I would love to call Captain Dave Main to present this award. The recipient of this award is Liema Hogaro. The next award is a um, Simina Spirit Award. And it will be shared between two learners and it's basically recognized two students who have been positive, proactive, helpful, engaging and have shown tremendous, is that the right English word? <laughs> Leadership, right. I would love to call the retired Real Admiral Watson of Simina National President and to come and hand over this award. Now, the two recipients of this award is Undi Pile and Juvandre. Danko, danko. Next up is the Society for Master Marina's Book Prize and it is awarded to a student who has shown interest in seamanship, practical involvement and interest 
in sailing. I would love to call Captain Kingdon to come and hand over this award. The recipient of this book prize is Silvino October. is the Captain Di Davis Memorial Prize for Nautical Science and it is awarded to Elena who achieved the highest mark in Nautical Science. Wow. I would love to call uh, their instructor, Commander uh, Rubier to come and help me. <laughs> but the recipient of this award is Andine. <laughs> <laughs> this one is given to a student to achieve the highest mark in maritime economics, which I deem the most important subject in the entire curriculum. <laughs> uh, I would love to call Mr. Johann Swart, the chairman of uh, the Low Hill Maritime Educational Trust, to hand over this award. <laughs> And the recipient of this one, well done, uh, Mr. Ntutugo <laughs> I need to be in this picture. <laughs> Waterfront Marine Sciences Award, and I would love to call um, Mr. Vusi Nondo to hand over this award. And the, not for you, <laughs> and the recipient of this award is Andy. <laughs> Courses to go and uh, start his career in the super yacht in Spain. Over and above that, he has now sponsored an award um, to two individuals. Um, uh, it's obviously awarded to someone who intends entering the maritime world, who has love for the ocean and has shown great perseverance and enthusiasm. Uh, in summary, great words. Mm -hmm. Lovely man. Um, I would love to call a uh, brother, Mr. Apiwe Rula from Cape Land, to hand over these awards. Now, the two recipients of these uh, Luto Thomas Spirit Awards are Mobile Kuswayo and Andine Collins Award. Now it's an award in memory of Captain Abbott who coached, mentored and guided so many maritime students and maritime personnel ashore over many, many years. I'm one of them. The industry lost a true gentleman, a quiet professional and a remarkable person. I would love to call again the chairman of the Logan Educational Trust, Mr. Johann Swart, to hand them over. <laughs> the two recipients of this uh, Miss uh, Diana Collins Award in memory of Captain Abbott are Tembi Mazula and Aluande Sitoli. <laughs> And presenting this prize to Silvana, Silvino October. The reality, ladies and gentlemen, is that we can award them all we like for the good work 
they'll carry it out in house. But life does not end here. Mm. In fact, people say after metric, that's where the real world starts. Mm. And what also makes our program much, much more special and unique is that we try our best to see our learners through after metric. Mm. So I think learnerships and uh, bursaries for next year. Mm. Um, so, firstly, for, for learnerships, I would love to call Miss Nicola Truta to announce the recipients of <laughs> Star Rock Green Road Learnerships. Good evening, everyone. Evening, ma'am. Um, before I got here, I sent a message to our CEO to say that we're on our way to Law, to the Law Hill Annual um, graduation ceremony tonight um, and I'm so excited and his response to me was oh that place is such a feel-good place mm -hmm. and I can honestly say those words resonated with me because after seeing everybody here tonight like I do every year we used to be able to come every year um, being here gives you hope and excitement for the future so matriculants um, you're going into the big world out there yeah, the big bad world, really. <laughs> and um, you know, it can either eat you up or it can make you strong. And what I've seen here and what I know from people who come out of Law Hill, you guys are going to go from strength to strength. So um, tonight we'd like to award three learnerships. Um, and so I'd like to call up the self proposed tall glass of hot chocolate. <laughs> And Mbalenshi Mukise. Yes, Right, and next up uh, to present uh, bursaries for tertiary education, mm -hmm. so, uh, my former boss, <laughs> Miss Vilna Kapp, to come on stage, please. To be Aubrey's ex boss is quite something. You must really be on your toes all the time. <laughs> now, for the award of the bursary, the tertiary bursary that we are awarding to one of the students, I just want to say congratulations to the recipient, but I also want to say to the rest of you that. It doesn't mean that you have not achieved anything. Don't give up. You're also part of the success and you're part of the future of the maritime industry. Thank you. Thank you, Mazuna. Thank you, Mazuna. Well, ladies and gentlemen, uh, it gives me great pleasure to announce uh, after much deliberation and uh, two, two recipients we've got. Uh, Mr. Nelly and Nelly May, Nokabiri, his wife. Right, last but definitely not least, um, the EA uh, TK Foundation Tertiary Bursary. It's a new a, a tertiary bursary to support the new Samtra Officer of the Watch course and we are very very wow. thankful to TK Foundation for the additional for this additional support over many 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 a uh, uh, lot of other supports I'm just thinking Mr. Pen will be chipping and painting containers uh, if it was not for TK <laughs> Foundation. Thanks good evening thank you very much for having me here today um, I'm here representing Susie Carlsvoy, who's the managing director of the TK Foundation. Um, she would have loved to have been here, but the flight from Joburg was easier than the flight from California, so you get me instead. <laughs> um, Susie has decided, she gets a managing director's discretionary fund, and she has decided to use all of the money, which is 50,000 US dollars, to go towards this bursary. Um, uh, Susie asked me to pass on the following words to you about this program. Uh, all of us at TK Foundation are very happy to be able to continue supporting the Maritime Cadets coming out of Law Hills High School program. This grant brings great joy to all of us as it touches on all of the TK Foundation's interests, youth and maritime and education. 
I'm very happy to announce that the recipient, the first recipient of this tertiary bursary is Girondre It's for uh, it's from Transnet National Port Authorities, and uh, I would love to call Miss Lorraine Mabindisa to present this last award. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and good evening to to the matriculants. Once again, well done on all your achievements. We really are so proud of you. Um, I think our relationship with Lord Hill goes back more than a decade, and we are so honoured to continue to to support Lord Hill and to be part of this amazing relationship. So this is really just a little something from the port of Cape Town to say well done to the top student and uh, continue learning. We wish you all the best as you go out into, into the big world. Um, we know you'll do your sponsors super proud as well as your family and really we wish you everything after the best. So thank you so much and keep up the good work that you're doing. The recipient of this award is the 2022 Valentine. Oh,